And as more cities grapple with these problems, there seems to be a shift away from NIMBYism, what we call Not In My Backyard, the anti-development acronym that has arisen. This shift away from NIMBYism to YIMBYism. The Y stands for yes. Katie, you've written a lot about this phenomenon in New York. The catalyst for that changing sentiment was is clearly the ha- the worsening housing crisis. But you have also f- reported that New York was really following in the footsteps of California. Can you talk about how the West Coast really led the charge on Yimbyism? You know, you've seen a lot of pro housing legislation pass in California. Um, you've seen you know increase in accessory dwelling units. Um, you've also seen these Yimby groups um, you know formalize and file lawsuits against communities that they feel are you know actively blocking new housing. And in Cal- in um, New York, you you've heard a lot about California in the past year because um, Governor Kathy Hochul in New York had proposed um, a housing plan that included something very similar to California's Builders Remedy which allows developers to bypass local zoning um, in event that they these communities don't, um, you know, abide by the housing growth targets. 